Easy, just be strong, be strong, be strong. Be strong, be strong, be strong. Hold on to me, hold on to me. Chandana, and I am your guardian angel. You may be seeing me most of the times as a snake because that's the symbol of your personal totem. I am with you and always at your back and call, Amarachi. That is what you will be named. Get a word, Hanno. Oh, I can't go. 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 Hi, Mr. Jofo. Hey, nurse. Good day, sir. Welcome, sir. Thank you very much. I came to see my lovely wife and our beautiful oh, baby. Wow. That's plenty. Um, yes, yes. Oh, I'm so happy. Please, uh, where's, where's the way to. Sir. You can say that again. <laughs> yeah, of course, I can say Where's that. the way to road nine here? Oh, oh, after me, sir. Oh, thank you very much. Hey. Thank you, God. Oh, 
Mommy. <laughs> what a beautiful baby. She looks just like you. For such a beautiful baby. She shall be called Amarachi. Class, we are going to learn one, two, three, four, five poem. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Good. One, two, three, four, five. Presentations all around. Why did you let them go? Because they beat my finger so. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. You tried, but I'm not impressed. Let's take it one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Why did you let them go? Because they beat my finger so. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Okay, let's take it one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Catch your fishes all around. Why did you let them go? Because they beat my finger so. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Good. Now, Nemeka, which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Which finger did they bite? The which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Amarachi, stand up. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Come. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Come on. Which finger did they bite? The little finger on my right. Be going, be going. Class, which finger did I bite? The little finger on my right. Good. Am I not better than you? By her. Am I not better than that you? By her. You are lying. Who talking? Who told you? Ooh, it's a lie. Everybody knows about it. It's Maybe you true. think nobody knows. It's a lie. Okay, you don't want to go. I back. don't want to go. You don't want to go. Yes. Go. Wait. Eh. I'm coming. I'm waiting for you. Hey, I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. Go and come. I wait for you here. Food. Where is she? She's not just her waist. From where? Ah! Honey, if you see what happened yesterday, when I and Mama Ugo were quarreling, she was really on my nerves. I asked her to go, she refused. I decided to come and get water to pour on that her useless body. So when I came out, she was no longer there. And I asked Amarachi, Amarachi said, a snake chased her away. Snake? I said, snake? Where? Where is the snake? Amarachi said, look at it. Mm -hmm. Lo and behold, a snake on my, near my legs. In this house? I screamed and ran for my dear life. Look, I can't understand. Mm -hmm. Where did this snake come from? I don't know. 
amazing. Make sure you pee before going to bed, though. Look, honey, while all this was happening, what was Amarachi doing? <laughs> you won't believe me. Amarachi was right there, laughing at us. <laughs> Look, I must get to the root of this snake issue. Please call Amarachi for me right now. I need to find out. Get to the root of this. With our daughter. The same snake that chased her away the other day. <laughs> but I didn't see any snake when I entered. You're not doubting me, are you? Eh, hey, Papa Marachi? Here's our sweet blessing for the Lord and the guest from the Lord of the salvation. So I'm going to sing in the Lord of the Lord. Lift up the head so you can have a shield of the King who shall come in for the King of Glory. The Lord strong and mighty, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up the head so you can have a shield of the King who shall come in. We need for the King of Glory. Amen. Amen. Glory be to God the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. At one beginning, never is at the world. Amen. Almighty God, thou God, creator of the universe, thou the maker of all things, thou the creator of heaven and earth, the Lord of our fathers. The God of our fathers, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, in the name of Jesus Christ, thou who had less me at a lesson today, thou who had less me at a spiritual revolution, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, come down and defend secretly, so to me, you that be revealing unto Jeremiah of God and to the prophets, the hour has come. The hour, Jesus! I said, the hour has come. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yes, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. There's nothing wrong with me. No. If anybody tells you that something is wrong with her, I wonder from where she the person might have seen that. Mm. Oh, she's okay. All she needs is prayers. Prophet, you mean there is nothing wrong with her? Nothing. Nothing. I've seen nothing wrong with her. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Right. Thank you, Lord. I told you there is nothing wrong with my daughter. Look, uh, uh, now, Marachi, are you sure you're not imagining these things? Thank you, Prophet.
Hello, pretty. How are you? How are you doing? I guess you're looking for your dad. But that's it, she'll bring you. Come on, let's give you a ride. Come in. Come in. Come inside. Come in, be a good girl. Come inside. Huh? What's funny? What's I'm missing you?
Amarachi. Come on. I know. <laughs> Come on now. Ah, you get to yourself worked up over nothing. I don't understand. Seriously, I'm really scared, you know. It's okay. Get us a bottle of water. Yeah, water. Yes. Come so, on. Um, I don't know. I'm just thinking like. Don't okay. you want to um, wait? No, no, no. Okay, just, just tell me. Would you, would you follow me to the airport this evening? Girl, can't you just wait for us to go together tomorrow? <laughs> Hell no, I will not wait. Namdi would have been the one to make me wait. Because he practically nailed down begging me to stay back so that we could travel tomorrow morning. Namdi. But I refused. <laughs> Namdi, Namdi, Namdi all the time. When are we going to meet this year? Namdi. <laughs> Don't worry, tomorrow, when he arrives. <laughs> but girls, listen, the birds will not die of starvation if you don't travel today. Trust me, they will die if I don't travel. Trust me, so I gotta go. <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. I wish you a safe trip. Okay. Oh, I'm so tired. Hi. Oh, uh, hi. Are you coming from San Buda Town? Yeah, I was actually born here. Oh, sorry. Hello, girl. Girl, you will not believe it. Let me wake up early today. Oh, okay. Do you want me to wait for you? <laughs> Don't worry, I will be there now. Just wait for me. Okay. <laughs> I missed you, girl. <laughs> I beg, I beg, girl, drop, 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 drop. My love is calling me. <laughs> okay. Bye. Hey, boo boo. Where have you been? I've been waiting for like all day. Yes, baby, I know, but I didn't wake up early today. Just, just wait, wait for me, okay? I'll be there now. Listen, you know I have an appointment in an hour time, and. Um... I can't afford to be late. Oh, honey, I know. Just hang up and hang on. I'll be there before you know it. Okay? <laughs> Bye, love. Bye. Oh, God. I have to work. 
Are you waiting for someone? Oh, um, yes, I'm actually waiting for my friend. Really? Yeah. So, um, are you waiting for somebody too? Yeah, I am waiting for my kid brother. Yeah, kid brother. Oh. This town is peaceful, very beautiful town, any good state. Yeah, it is. You sound like you don't live around here. Nah. Um, well, <laughs> my name is Amarachi. You don't have an English name? Rachel. <laughs> my name is Paul. Okay. Alright, I have to hit the road now. I've got to catch up with an appointment. Um, but you said that um, you're waiting for your brother. Yes, but I have an appointment that I'm running late already. Okay. Do you have a phone? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, like, you really didn't ask me that question, did you? I mean, of course I have a phone. Please, let me have your phone. Okay. Good. Now that I have your number, I am going to bug the living daylight out of you. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> All right. Nice meeting you once more. Same here. All right. Take care. Okay. Bye. Hmm. 
There you are, Gandalf. I am always here at the So tell me, what are you up to? Well, I am so happy with Amarachi that I will never want to kill her. So you see, that prophecy is wrong. The prophecy, the prophecy must, must come, come to pass. pass. I said to work extra hard to avert it. She will possess something that belongs to you. And you will ask me to kill her. So for crying out loud, what is this thing that she is going to possess? What? If you claim to know the future, what is this? There are things my eyes are allowed to see. And there are things that are kept away from me. Gaga, I will never want to kill Amarachi. If there is anything of mine that she wants, I will give it to her. The word is caution. Adeze, you have to leave. Adeze, you have to relocate from this city to prevent this from happening. So what happens to our poultry? What happens to it? That is the only business we have for ourselves. Please, Uganda, give me a break. The prophecy must come to pass, except to work extra hard to avert it. She will possess something that belongs to you, and you will ask me to kill her. Okay, Ganda. I should have waited for you, but time wasn't on my side, so I had to take a taxi. Boo boo. Boo, you're still angry with me. I'm not. I'm okay, I'm fine. So how long are you staying this time? Um, I should be staying longer than I used to because, um, you know, we just started a new branch in this town. Yay! Yeah, I should stay till uh, Victoria is able to get acquainted with our new modus of operandi. Oh, please, that bitch. What happened to you? Hey, what's up? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, hello, hello, Paul. Hi. Yeah, how are you? How are you? Um, <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. I'm, I'm just checking on you to know how you're doing. Oh, that's so thoughtful of you. You're not in bed yet? Well, I, I'm about to. I just decided to call you and to know how you're doing. I'll call you tomorrow. I, I'll call you tomorrow. All right. Thanks, I do appreciate it. Okay. Bye. I'll be upstairs. I need to take my shower. Okay.
What reason would I have to kill you? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> what did you just say? Well, Ganda says I'll kill you when you turn 25. <laughs> who, who, who is Ganda? My snake. <laughs> Your snake. You told me that you don't have a snake. You didn't really want to know. I would have told you the truth. Hello. Yeah. I was wondering if we could do lunch together. Oh my god, that would be wonderful. Like, that would be fabulous. I would love to. <laughs> Lovely. All right then. See you later. What? What? Would you really want to kill me? <laughs> what reason would I have to kill you, Amarachi, my dear sister? I, I really don't know. I, I, I don't know. Okay, but what did he tell you that would make you want to kill me? Who knows? He says you would take something that belongs to me. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I mean, I mean, th that is very funny. I mean, what would I take that possibly belongs to you? What? <laughs> Who knows? My life. <laughs> your life? Yeah. <laughs> if I took your life, I would not be scared of losing mine. Because you will already be dead. And you cannot come from the grave and kill me. Yeah, that's true. So what, so what is this thing? What's, what is this thing of mine that you would want to possess? <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. The poultry. <laughs> this poultry is the only precious thing to you that we share, is the poultry. So Amarachi, if at all, you took the poultry investment and maybe I'll get mad at you or something. But let me tell you something. Even if you, you took the poultry investment and everything, I'll not even bulge. Okay, fine. I have a great idea. Let's, let's sell the poultry. You know, we could share the proceeds equally. I mean, you can even take 60% for all. Like, you can even take it all. I, I don't really care. Just. Is that what you want? Listen. Yes. Okay, I am doing it for us. I'm trying to help us here. Yeah. You know, let's just continue with the feeding, okay? We'll talk about that later. Come on. Let's feed. Let's feed the
so you called? Yes, I did. I will not be returning to the office after lunch today. I have an important appointment. Okay, sir. Good. So you take care of the office? Yeah. We have 400 files and they're all in good health. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it, it's okay, yeah. Um, can you come around now? Um, 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 I'm, re I'm really, really sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, can we make it around 5 p.m.? I, um, I have, I'll be busy right now. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you. Yeah, bye. No, sir. It's not entirely mine. No, the poetry belongs to my friend and I. Yes. Oh, okay. We have about 400 birds. Okay. All right. No, no, they're not all broilers now. Okay. Oh, that's a good one, sir. <laughs> all right, thank you very much. We're waiting. Bye. Oh my God, yes! God, I'm so happy. Oh, she would not believe this. Hey, girl. Hello, sister, what's up? Oh, my darling, you will not believe this. We just got a prospective buyer. <laughs> what? Like, seriously, you just did? I just got one right now. Are you serious? Hmm, what a coincidence. Anyway, girl, you better start coming. I'm waiting for you. Hmm? Um, listen, listen. Can we make it around 5 p.m.? Why? Okay, I, uh, I have a lunch date with Paul. Hmm. Babe, you and this your Paul. The way things are going, I am very sure you are the one that will get him an engagement ring. Hmm. You better pipe low, girl. <laughs> Just stop it. Oh, girl. Girl, I love you. Anyway, no problem. You just have fun, okay? I'll handle it. Kiss, kiss. Bye-bye, <laughs> darling. Take care, darling. Bye. Yeah. This is a good one. I just hope it works. Mm. Amen. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> You look gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. You look good too. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I have forgotten your name. Well, my name is a household name, and if you wanted to see me again, you wouldn't have forgotten my name. My bad. Please tell me again for the last time. Well, my name is Amarachi. I'm just hearing that for the first time. Sit down. Thank you. So, Marachi, ever since the first day I met you at the airport, my life has never remained the same again. Oh, uh, thank you. Mm. Chocolate, please. Red wine? Thank you. Okay, so um, are you in any way <laughs> toasting me? Is that what it is called, is this? Like... Taking a girl out on a date and telling her that you believe you've fallen in love with her? Listen, are you asking me out stylishly? You know what? I will not succumb to a backdoor Tuesday. If you want me to ask properly. Okay. So, what about us? Going into business together. I 
I am not a business woman. I am talking about the business of the heart, Amaraji. I want our hearts to come together. Then we'll live under the same roof and have plenty of babies. Then we will invest in them. The academics, the welfare, the health, and we will watch them grow and undertake other businesses. And they will grow in their businesses, and their businesses will grow and give birth to other businesses. Then, someday, in old age, we'll look at each other, eyeball to eyeball, and say, such a wonderful business partner we've been. Well, that doesn't sound as a very difficult business after all. So, are you willing to undertake such business with me? Give me the contract. Do I need to be nice having you as a business partner? <laughs> Same here. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. My dear, mm -hmm. just like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Honestly, to think that my own boyfriend, Namde, is just the total opposite of yours. Aww. Do you know I waited for 12 whole months for him to ask me out? But girl, he eventually did. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he didn't. I was the one that asked him out. Oops. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, Honestly, that is so sweet. Uh, honestly, it's sweet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, girl, you girls, you guys are cool. That's the most important thing, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're happy, and I'm happy for you. Yeah. <laughs> That's what matters. Vicky. Vicky, your phone is ringing. Hello, sir. Hello, Vic. Can you do me a favor? Anything, sir. Okay, I am on my way to a ring shop. I want to go get a ring for- Box and ring that you find very, very disturbing. I just feel if it's something you put that you should go for it. Are you suggesting that I ask my boss out? Hmm? There's no big deal. Just like saying good morning. to you. Sorry I was not brought up there, but excuse me. Yeah, like we were brought up by different parents. been checking up on me lately. Yeah, very, very busy. Mm, I know, I know, I thought as much. <laughs> but honey, um, what would you say if we hang out tonight? You know, we'll do dinner or something. Honey, don't say no. That would be totally unfair. Okay, dinner by eight. Okay. Right on time. So before we go into the business of the day, I need you to give me an advice quickly. Anything, sir. Okay. I met a girl yesterday. And I want to propose to her today. Secondly, I want to break up with my girlfriend. What do you have to say? I, I think meeting a girl yesterday and already you're in love with her is um, 
it's a little bit on the hasty side and, and breaking up with your girlfriend because of this new girl it's very unfair listen I met you yesterday and I like you you met me yesterday and I believe you like me Is it premature for you to like me? <laughs> no, sir. I really like you. Good. So what are you saying? Time is inconsequential when it has to do with matters of love and heart. I agree. But I'd like to ask. The girl you want to break up with now, you once loved her, right? Victoria, when you see a woman you want to marry, you will recognize her immediately. I knew Amarachi is the one for me. Immediately I set my eyes on her. I don't understand. Don't worry, you'll get to understand when you meet the man that we get married. Namdi, my boyfriend, is asking me out. And I am so looking forward to it. My girl, I envy you so much. You know, I'm going to be all by myself alone in this your lonely house, stuck here. Are you serious? Yes. Why not call your boyfriend and tell him how bored you are that he should come take you out for dinner? Seriously, this man standing before I know next to nothing. Please, I can't continue with you. No. This is too harsh. Okay. I mean, wouldn't that sound as if I'm pushing too hard? Pushy? Yes. <laughs> Let me tell you something, darling. If he loves you so much, he will consider it an honor. Come on, call him. Girl, are you serious? Should I? Of course. Tick, tick. The clock is okay, ticking. Okay, okay. I'll try. I'll try. Oh, girl. I don't know if he's going to. Oh, my goodness. Just call him. Are you serious? Okay. Um. Hello, darling. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, hi, my love. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. Still here. About to go out. Well, you're about to go out. Oh, God. So I'm going to be the only one all by myself tonight. I mean, everyone in the whole world is going out except me. I, I feel so bored. Uh-uh. You want to go out? Yes, I would love to. Uh, Alright, um, will it be too late if I invite you out for dinner tonight? Well, <laughs> um, well, okay, I guess this will be part of our business, right? Okay, 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 um, um, will 8 p.m. be okay? 8 p.m., um, I'll be waiting for you. I'll, I'll, I'll come pick you up, all right? Okay, um, see you then later then. Bye-bye. <laughs> yeah! I told you, I told you! Oh, oh, oh. I'm going out with you. I'm not the other one. 
get dressed right. It's eight o'clock, right? Of okay, see Come you later. Go. Bye. Here, Victoria. This is really going to be very difficult. Um, sir, from the look of things, you are in a mess. For Christ's sakes, I am breaking up with her tonight. I still have not gathered myself the courage to do that. Uh, but there has to be a way to fix it, I'm sure. Yeah. I know, I know. Uh, can, let me call you back, okay? I have an incoming call. Okay, sir. You're looking for a solution to his problems, whatever it is. Yeah. Can you imagine? He fixed two dinner dates between. Wow. He's even a player. Your boss friend. And what? Your boss friend. Seriously, Vicky. Look at it this way. The butterfly sees herself as a bird, but the bird sees her as food. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Okay. Interpret. To you, he's the love, oh love of your life. But to him, you're nothing but an advisor. So, I think you guys need each other for a purpose. I don't know, whatever. Well, this is not the time to be silly, all right? Not the time. All I need is to... Vicky! What? Do you mind? I am not interested. I am not feeling this dress. I don't feel comfortable in this dress at all. I really don't feel comfortable. I look horrible. Do you think I would allow you wear something that doesn't fit? Come on, you better wear this, okay? You wouldn't want to keep him waiting, would you? I don't like it. Trust me, it's good. Huh? Yeah, it's okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let me try. That's why you have me. How does it look now? You know, you look hot and sexy. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Give me five, darling. Thank you. You see? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're my girl. <laughs> you too. <laughs> oh, God. 8 p.m., you know. Adeze, you look good. Well, you know what? You look better. And I am very sure when Paul sees you, he would know they couldn't have been a better girl for him. Are you serious? <laughs> of course so I am. Oh, I just hope so, you know. <laughs> um, girl, Paul would be so proud of you. There couldn't have been a better girl for him. I just, I just hope that he knows how strongly you feel for him. I don't know. No. Uh, but he will. He will. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, yeah, um, he'll be here soon. Okay. Yeah, I was about saying the same thing too. <laughs> One hour wait is a long time. One hour? Girl, I have to go home right now because I wouldn't want him to come and not meet me. <laughs> it's okay, you go. I will be here waiting for him. Uh, no, listen, Namdi will not keep you waiting. Mm. Stop it. All right? <laughs> come here. Yeah. Oh. Be good. Mm, and have, have a nice time. time. You too. Okay. <laughs> have a nice time. <laughs> be good. Be good, darling. Bye. Hello, Victoria. I'm so nervous right now. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. Sir, I think you should call her and cancel the appointment. It's not very nice to keep a lady waiting. 
Yeah, I know. Maybe I should just call her up and tell her that I have a flat tire. Sir, tires don't take up to 15 minutes to fix. Oh, Victoria, you're too thorough for my liking. I'm sure your boyfriend must be going through hell. Right. Oops! What? Are, are you okay, sir? I think I just have a flat tire. Oh, my. Now I'm in a big situation right now and I don't know how to get out of this mess. It's okay. Don't panic. I I am sending a card to you right after this call. Just SMS me your current location. Yes, I'll do that right away. I don't want to wait for too long. You know my appointment is for 8 o'clock. And I have to go to her house and pick her up. Um, sir, can I make a suggestion? Go ahead. It had better be good, Vicky. He called me Vicky. Um, <clears throat> sir, uh, maybe you should call her and tell her you had a flat tire. Call who? Amachi. Call her and tell her that you don't want to keep her waiting, so she should meet you up. Uh, okay. okay, sir. What? Seriously, this man owns his life to you. That was a brilliant suggestion. I know. Hello, Paul. Sweetie, I'm in a little situation with my car at the middle of the road. for evil. Two evils are roaming around your boss <sighs> and eventually they got him. What does it mean? Your boss is going to die. Ah! What? Yes. What? Mommy, your boss will not die. Anyway. Your boss will not die. Yes, Come down. Anyway. Kneel down, let us pray. Anyway. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. My father, my father, my father, my maker. Amen. Everlasting Lord, the great Adam that I am. Unchangeable changer, Father, we thank you. We glorify your own name because you are worthy to be praised. Father, we commit your boss into your hands care. Father, we pray that nothing, nothing, no man has authority in your boss' life in Jesus' name. Amen. Wherever your boss are now, Father, I commit as his soul. I couldn't claim I heard the thoughts of you. Oh, that sounds really nice. 
but I'm here now. Yeah, I know. That's why I want to put you in a ring and make sure you remain there. <laughs> you want to put me in a ring? <laughs> that sounds ambiguous. Nah. It means only one thing. Would you marry me? You know, I would have said yes if you came with a ring. So. Really? Mm -hmm. Hmm. What's that? What? What's that? What? What is that? Now I have a ring. Not even a call. Are you sure he's all right? Are you calling Ada? Namdi, who are you there with? What do you mean nobody? So why are you calling me Ada? Why? So what happens to baby? Listen baby, I am not fine, right? I, I have a flat tire and I'm so stressed out. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Okay, just tell me where you are and I'll come meet you up. No, 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 that won't be necessary. Don't worry, I can sort myself out. You know what, Ada? I, I, I think we should just um, cancel this appointment for tonight. Maybe we could just hook up some other time. <sighs> Namdi, you're kidding me, right? Namdi, you are kidding me. Listen, Ada, I am so stressed out, okay? Don't make my night worse than it already is. Namdi, Paul, okay, okay. You've been acting up strangely for the past 48 hours. You wouldn't want me to release my venom, would you? I am not in the mood for all these harassments. Besides, we need to talk. You, you, you should be in the mood. Do you hear me? You should be. Andy! Hello? 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 He hung up on me. He. He hung.
Hey, um, listen, I don't know, listen, okay, um, can you just, um, come out here and meet us, okay? I mean, we can hang out together. It's even an opportunity for you to even be bored, you know? No, 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 girl, that won't be necessary. I wouldn't want to dampen your bloom with my gloom. I think I can always see Paul some other time when I'm feeling much better, okay? It, it, it's okay, it, it's, it's okay, I, I totally understand, okay, I understand. But listen, whatever will make and understand you all must be genuine, okay? And it does not strike me as a guy that will say A and mean B. You know what, girl? I am so scared. Because I have this feeling that my Namdi is seeing another girl. That would be the worst thing that would happen to anyone. It's okay, that would be fine. I'll, I'll talk to you later. Yeah. Good night. You look sad. I'm not. It's just my friend that is not happy. You know, relationship issues. Too bad. I pray for her to find a man. Yeah. Me too. Oh my goodness. Hello? Hello? You know, I was about calling you. I, I, I had a nightmare. Yeah, I, I had a nightmare too. Are you, are you there? I had a nightmare. I dreamt the same thing. You know, I dreamt... Why must I ask you to kill her? That's what the prophecy says. Then you have to go, Randall. If you will be the one that I'll ask to kill Anarachi, then you must leave my life. I am here to protect you. snake before. I only sent it away because of you. Listen, it was also very painful for me when I sent mine away. She was becoming a nuisance and my parents were getting really scared. So right now my snake is gone. So that means you are free from death in my hands. That's awesome. That will also make you feel free for any future gifts. Listen, 
I am so happy that you took that decision. I am really happy and I feel forever indebted to you. Mm. I swear. Because I sent my snake away? Hmm? Yeah. Honestly, I'm actually. I feel so alone. I feel as if I feel as if my life is endangered. You know, I've never been without my snake before. This is the first time he's out of my sight. So, uh, tell me, tell me about your fiancé. Have you guys settled your little problem? <laughs> that. He has refused to pick my comments. And that alone is, is killing me softly. I love him and it's so... So much that I can even kill for him. Seriously, listen now. Whatever that is worth living for is what done. But hey, I could put in a word for you, okay? I mean, you're my friend, you're my sister, so I could talk to him. I could tell him how much you love him. Yeah. <laughs> you know, no. Honestly, that, that would be so great, but, you know, I, I feel it's okay, I just talk to him myself, you know, let's reason it out, you know. The only time you come in is when all efforts have been defeated. <laughs> it's okay about you. I know you got my back. I got your back. <laughs> but if it's okay about you, then fine. Yes, this meeting is very important because I am meeting her best friend today and I'm taking him out for a treat on her request. Her best friend is heartbroken so she wants us to make her feel good. Sir, nothing can mend a broken heart. But you can surely patch it. Ah. So, how do I look? You good? But you also look too official. I don't understand. Well, you know, you, you, you have that prim and proper look and you don't want to come off as a shrink when you get there. I would have preferred you in casuals for where you're going to. If you don't mind, I know a place we can get you some really smart clothes. My bills. Let's go. I'll just grab my bag. It's all right. I love him and I want him. You know, I don't know how, how you see this, but I want you to help me talk to your boyfriend so that he could fix a meeting with Namdi, please. Yeah, don't. I'm going to ask him to call him. He can talk one this issue. You're going to go as his assistant and you're going to have a chance of meeting him there. Then you guys can sort out the difference. Okay. 
okay? Yeah. Oh my god, I think it's one here. Come, 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 let's go, let's go, please come. Let me just wipe away my tears, okay? I'll, I'll just open the door for him. Okay, okay, okay. You look five years younger. Really? Yes. Thanks for the compliment. Oh. Okay, come in. Thank you. You've got a nice place. Thank you. Okay, um, please have a seat. Mm -hmm. 